Adding pictures, graphs, or charts to your PowerPoint can help engage an audience. To add a picture, click the Insert tab and then the Picture icon. The Insert Picture dialog box appears. Select the picture file you want to insert. You may need to navigate to a different folder or drive to get that picture. Then just click the Insert button. Your picture appears in the center of the slide. If you decide you don't want a picture you've already selected, just delete it. Select the picture, and handles appear around it. Then press the Delete or Backspace key. If you want to move your picture to a different spot on your slide, click the picture. Once handles appear around it, it's selected. Then you can click the mouse and drag and drop the picture where you want it, or press the up and down arrow keys to move it around. To resize a picture, select it, and then move the handles to adjust it. Just move your mouse over the handles, click and drag. If you drag a corner handle, you can change the height and width at the same time. Or in the Format tab, you can type a precise width and height in the designated text box displayed in the Size group. You can rotate a picture in a similar way as you rotate a text box. Select the picture you want to rotate. Move your mouse pointer over the Rotate handle. It turns into a circular arrow icon. Then click and drag the mouse to rotate it the way you'd like. Sometimes you might want to include an image of an actual computer screen to show a program or a competitor's website to others. If you need a screenshot, PowerPoint can import all or part of a screen. To capture a screenshot, click the slide you want to add it to. Click the Insert tab, and then the Screenshot icon in the Images group. A menu appears showing all the currently open windows. Click on whichever screenshot you want to capture. PowerPoint displays a screenshot on the slide you chose. Adding extra elements like pictures and screenshots can help your PowerPoint presentation stand out from the rest.